Have you ever worried about getting towed or wondering where your car is? 22 News reporter Dave McKay explains the rules and regulations for tow trucking. Yeah, it's a busy season for tow truck drivers with winter conditions on the roadways, but there's also people parking in places they shouldn't to be closer to their destinations. Dude, where's my car? Heart sinks, wallet whines, and after a few phone calls, you could find out you've been towed. Why is my car towing? Because you didn't follow directions. You have to follow the rules. Sometimes easier said than done. 22 News got a few phone calls from people upset they've been towed from the post office parking lot in Springfield. In fact, we even witnessed a woman about to be towed today, but the signage explicitly states you will be towed if you do not have business at the post office. This woman got off the line because her mother was inside. Tow truck companies have contracts with state police and private companies. So many times in the parking lot that you're parking in, you can see on the sign the name of the company that could have towed you. In Massachusetts, the Department of Public Utilities sets the rate for a non-consensual tow, whether by police or privately owned parking lot. Any non-consensual tow is $90 uh, uh, for the hookup fee. Uh, $3 a mile round trip, you get five miles free. Um, mileage is computed from the home base shop to the location of the tow back to the shop again. And there's a state fuel surcharge. It fluctuates by month and it's currently 2.6%. So what if you run out and see your car getting towed away? And that becomes a private tow at that point where you can negotiate uh, a fair rate to drop the vehicle. And it will almost always be cheaper than going to pick it up. You can find the state's towing rates through our website at WWLP.com. David McKay, 22 News.